Yo, 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 it's Adam Coe again here. July 28th, Tuesday. Giants are back at it tonight uh, against the San Diego Padres at home finally. Um, Jeff Samard is going to hop on the mound for the first time, uh, which I think was a great move by Gabe Kapler. Uh, he didn't have great numbers against the Dodgers, who have a great lineup, and a lot of those guys dominated him in the, in the past. So to uh, get him at home against the Padres, who he has a lot more success against, um, is, a, is a smart move. Get him uh, some success here early uh, in his first start. Uh, I'm excited to see what he's got for us. The bullpen is is um, is all all ready because they had a day off yesterday, uh, so every guy should be it should be ready if they need you know if need be. Um, we're going against Zach Davies, who we've seen in the past with the, with the Brewers, who uh, got traded to the to the uh, Padres. Uh, doesn't throw very hard, but and his, he just kind of keeps everybody off balance, and um, hopefully we can get to him early and get to the bullpen at the beginning of the series. The Padres had a, a good start against the Padre, uh, against the Diamondbacks. Sorry, uh, they won three out of four. Uh, won the series yesterday against the the D-backs, who have a really good team. So uh, winning three to start the year is great for them. They have a very young team. Um, obviously Tatis Jr., uh, who has a good who had a great start. Tommy Pham was a great. Um, great addition for them, um, and uh, obviously they have Hosmer and they got Grisham in a trade, so they have guys. Their lineup is a lot deeper than we're used to, so uh, we're not gonna take it for granted. I think they're actually in first place. They are so. Uh, if we can win a couple games here against the Padres and get, get keep going, uh, it'd be a great start with uh, some Marge on the mound tonight. Um, let's. I was looking at the numbers against Davies, and uh, I'm my player of the game tonight. Uh, who I think is going to have the best the best night is uh, Pablo, Pablo Sandoval. If he's in the lineup, I, the lineups haven't came out yet, but um, he has the most, he only has, he has the only homer against Zach Davies in the in the past against the Brewers. Um, and, you know, a couple doubles. So he's one of those guys, he hits the low ball well. He likes to hit uh, balls that are balls. He likes to hit, he likes to hit out of the zone pitches and, that's what Zach Davies tries to do. He doesn't throw hard, so he's going to try to make you swing at his pitch, and that's what Pablo Zanwell likes to do. So uh, hopefully uh, he can get get a hold of one and uh, put one in the bay, possibly. Uh, the lineup, I this is my projected lineup. Uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, I just want to see if I'm right. So I want Yaz at top, obviously, uh, with the righty on the mound. Let's go with Flores at third. That and two, he's just consistent. Pablo, three. Uh, I want uh, Alex Dickerson, four. Uh, he's got the most pop probably in our lineup against righty, so put him in there. I want Darren Ruff as a DH today. Keep that guy in the lineup. He's hitting the ball well. He steals bases. He's fast. He does it all. Put Darren Ruff in there. Uh, he, they probably won't, but Darren Ruff should be in the lineup every day until he proves us otherwise. He should be in the lineup. Uh, I also think Donovan Solano, uh, keep him in there at second base. They'll probably put du Dubon in there, but Solano's been hitting the ball well. Um, Except for that one error. It's the only, only blemish for him so far. Uh, let's throw Crawford a short. Keep that defense and that lefty in the line. He's been hitting the ball well. He's had about three or four balls right at right fielder, center fielder on the shift. He's hit, he's hit into the shift quite quite a few times as well. So uh, put him in the eight, eight spot. And then Tyler Heineman, I think he's an awesome guy to have at the nine spot. Uh, he gets on base a lot. He works the count. He's almost like a second leadoff hitter. Uh, so put him at the bottom of the lineup. To flip it over to Yaz, and uh, I don't see why we wouldn't start him every day until hopefully Joey Bart comes. I will. I will. I don't even care if Joey Bart comes up and strikes out the first six at bat. Just want to see that man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, in San Francisco. So, uh, yeah. So that's my that's my projections for the day. Hopefully, uh, hopefully we start the series off strong. Uh, after having, you know, momentum's going our way. We're, we, like, I heard Dubon talk. He's just a bunch of scrappy guys on the team. Um, he was saying that they're just playing better baseball. The first two games, we should have won game one. I didn't really talk about it much, but game one, we were right there. We had guys on base all day long. Uh, bases loaded one time. We only scored once. First and third, we didn't score. So, I mean, we could have easily won three out of four. I know it's the, the we lost by eight, but we could have easily won that first game. So, uh, yeah, two and two, going into going into a series with San Diego. Um, excited about it tonight. 
I w- I'm not going to talk much about the Marlins situation. I'm just going to let that be. Um, it's kind of a tough situation right now. Uh, more, four more players uh, got COVID this morning. I mean, what are you going to do? The Nationals said they're not going to not going to travel to Miami. Kind of don't blame them. Uh, hopefully they can figure something out where Miami players can go to Washington and play there. Um, but, I mean, it's just a tough situation. Hopefully we get this figured out and uh, the scheduling all lines up to make this you know an official year and no more cases. It was good to see the Phillies didn't have any cases today. So um, that's all good news. Uh, if you guys want to see anything else, let me know. Like I said, subscribe. Tell your friends. I'm, I'm just doing this because I'm bored. Um and I, I love talking Giants baseball. I love talking baseball as well. I'm probably going to make some videos uh, just talking about what I see in the major leagues and some of the players that are you know, catching my eye. Um, but, yeah, let me know what you, what you, how, you, how you guys like the video so far and what I should add to them, anything. Uh, you can follow me on Twitter, uh, Adam Co knows. Uh You can follow my Instagram, Adam Cosina. Uh, yeah, just let me know, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Go Giants. Let's go.